Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy, Colonel Ribbit at your service. Let's see what Professor Rackham and Professor Fig have to say about the memory I saw. What have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir, and this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor Rookwood. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You'll need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter. Of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood, do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now, tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies, yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. Love that. Don't neglect your studies, even though I've done like three assignments already. Oh, Halloween is here. So it's officially autumn. Well, like a month has gone by, I, I suppose. And what has happened to my cape? What, why is my cape through me? <laughs> Well, anyway, I should get into my school uniform anyway. <laughs> you know. Um, you gotta love the graphics on like a game like this. Okay, let's see. Oh no, that's got pants. We don't like pants. That is really cute, though. We should probably have. Um, Long sleeves, considering the weather. I love the brown shoes. Uh, maybe a scarf? Hmm, maybe, maybe. I like that. But do we want to go for something a little bit more simple? Hmm. 
No, that's not too constricting. Yeah, we'll go with that. I like that. How would you like to learn the knockback jigs flipendo? Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Yay, I have another assignment. Lux Wade. Okay, someone told me I'm gonna need to get some more spellcrafts. Um I should ask Serona the three broomsticks. That's some spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha! Stop by the shop when you can. I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I have set for you. I would like to teach you to send off useful for pulling objects to the ground. It seems everyone wants me right now. Oh, there's a side quest over here too. Okay, let's go to Hogsmeade first. See what I'll be weeks once. I've got some more gear to sell anyway. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. This lot will basically pay for that. Oh, I should go to the um, map chamber and have a look at what this unidentifiable gear is. I'll be going there anyway because I've got to grow some luck speed. I don't even think I have luck speed. Oh. I must tell you, half of Ogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? Yeah, sure. Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. Why would I change the broom? Like, I have a really awesome broom. Okay, next I need to go to a shop. Bell crafts, I don't know. Okay. Off to the races then. Kitty! Wondering when I'd see you again. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Okay, so it tells me I'm gonna need a medium and I'm gonna need a large. Thing is, though. What do I go for? 
Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? We'll go with the cheap options. Come on, do I need anything? I think that's relevant. Um, let's go make sure we've got all the seeds and bulbs. So anything else I can do to help. whatever I need to plant. Uh, so we want to go to the magic neat first. That last oh, it's you. What a pleasant surprise. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. You know what, with all this running, I'll keep warm. Oh, you look like Raggedy Ann. as well. Do you have anything else I can steal? Oh, yes you do. Um such a wee bear and gain a thrash into a troll. Oh, I can't believe it. Shush gosh, talking so loud. Yeah, I think I know where it is. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, and if it wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really. But it was just the one. Now then, how may I help you today? I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. Let me know if you see anything you like. What do you have for sale? It kind of creeps me out. Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. 
用过吧。You're a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? Uh -huh. Scaring, doors always open. You be sure to stop by soon. Oh. Okay, let's go to the map chamber. Not the map chamber, the room of requirement. <laughs> oh boy, there's so many secret rooms. Ah, Deke is still cleaning my floor. Good. Anything? Oh, they're all good. Decreased damage taken from spiders. Nice, nice. Loving that. Nope, didn't get a new pair of that. Didn't get a new hat. I believe I've got a new scar. Decreased damage taken from dark wizards. Nice, loving that too. Imperio target does extra damage. Am I gonna get Imperio? That is hideous. Okay. Um, okay. Oh, this is like the worst game of Sims ever. <laughs> oh, I can... Well, I guess I'll put two down. Honestly, I don't know what I'm doing with my space. And then I guess I'll put a lot. Deke, you're in the way. Okay, I'll just put a large one there and then. I don't know. There? Most excellent. Okay, maybe we should put another little one out. We're gonna just have a chaos of these, but it's fine. I don't care. Okay, and then I guess did I get some potions or should I get some more? Okay, let's just stick some of these down.
That'll do. Now let's get planting. Um, we'll put a shrivel fig in you. Planting cabbage in you. Um, mallow sweet. Mandrake. Uh, flip feed, so I've got to throw that. And a venomous tentacula. I've got Dittany growing there. Also, what am I missing? I don't care. Um, what was the quest again? Okay, grow and harvest flux weed, doing it. Acquire all three common plants and use them simultaneously. Right, I can do that as well. Collect troll bogies. Cast a pulso on a levitated enemy. Okay. Where am I going to get a troll? So glad these don't take all that long. Lovely. Right. Um, yeah, these are going to take like 15 minutes. So we can come back to this. Let's go do something important, I guess. Alright, let, let, let's see what's going on over here. What you did in Cross Wand was pretty. Yes, aren't I amazing? Now, if you'll excuse me, I do not have time to socialize. Should have gone to Hogwarts sooner. Please. Woody stairs. Oh, Alright, to climb down, I suppose, but getting back up them? Nah. Could see another bench halfway up, you'll need it. Still, I must look absolutely crazy running down all these stairs. Why did I never learn how to swim? Uh, that sounds like a you problem. I 
I really should look into gillyweed, although I'm going for a swim. Goodness, no. Though I'm beginning to think I really should learn how to swim. Can't very well be liaison to the mer people if I don't know how to swim. You're a liaison to the mer people? Well, not technically, no. At least not yet. The position doesn't actually exist at the moment, but I have a plan to change that. I'm Nerida, by the way. Nerida Roberts. We didn't officially meet, but we jeweled him across Swan's Club. <laughs> yes, of course. Good to see you again. And you. You seem quite interested in mer people. I am. And they're as misunderstood and disregarded by wizard kind as goblins and centaurs are. I feel that if goblins and centaurs have liaison officers at the ministry, then the mer people should have one too. I'm impressed. I think reaching out to the mer people is a grand idea. You do? Oh, thank you. Of course, I haven't exactly done anything just yet. I presented them with a gift a few weeks ago, and they wanted to leave me one as well, in one of their caves. Reciprocity and an offer to visit. I tried telling them I couldn't swim, but I'm afraid that bit got lost in translation. Mermish really is tricky. Well, I can swim and could help you if you'd like. You'd really do that? Oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you. The last thing I want is for them to think I shunned their gift. Diplomacy is a delicate dance. Now, if I'm not mistaken, I think you can dive down to their cave from just there in the water. I can't wait to hear about what you find. One day soon, I'll see for myself. I just know it. It better not be a trap. Look, I'm hearing some soulful music right now. Look at this place. Did the mer people really leave Merida an artifact? Lumos. Incendio! Lumos. Now then, I'll need you to come with me. Now for the rest of you. Incendio! What do we have in here then? Merida will be happy about this. Oh, pretty. Huh. I was hoping I could have something, but you know. Probably one of those, you know, flat wear jewelry in school. Your gift from the mer people was exactly where they said it would be. Oh, that's wonderful news! I was so worried I'd left it too long and they'd seen it as a slight. Our relationship with them is already so tenuous. No, I'm not keeping it. That's awful. Then I'm glad we helped to foster some healthy diplomatic relations. Merlin's beard. It's marvellous. I'm going to show it to everyone, including the Ministry. Should I hand deliver it or send by owl? Thank you again so much. You may have just helped improve relations between wizard kind and mer people for decades to come.
I can't wait to study this. Oh, a mermish liaison uniform. That's cool. Yeah, no, I'm not climbing up all these stairs. Where am I going next? Oh, yes, a troll. Now, I remember there being a side quest about a troll in here. Was it? No. Yep, there it is. Okay, we'll go in here. And then I guess we can use all the plants on the troll as well. Honestly, you just expect me moving around this lot all the time. Uh, right. Um, uh, oh, well, there's one right next to me here. Oh, it's here. What needs doing needs doing. Is everything all right? If the Hamlet sent you here to talk to me about, about, I know what I have to do. It's not every day a girl has to put down her own troll. I should be allowed to work up to it. What do you mean, your own troll? I thought that's why you were here. I'm sorry. <sighs> I suppose if you spend enough time with trolls, you forget your manners. I'm Alexandra. I didn't mean to be short with you. With Ranrock's lot seemingly everywhere, I thought the Hamlet could use a bit more security. <sighs> but my plan has gone awry. I apologized when he almost trampled half the Hamlet yesterday. <sighs> he just needs more time. But everyone wants him gone. They think it's mad, my training a troll. Impossible, even. I'm inclined to agree with them. Trolls are dangerous creatures. I know. I know. But I had to try. I suppose I understand why everyone's been so concerned. What made me think I could train him? I should have learned from Barnabas the Barmy. But he's my troll and my problem. I'll be honest. I'm afraid I won't be able to take care of him. He's stronger than any troll I've ever encountered. I wish I knew someone else who could do it. Then I'll do it. I'm not thrilled at the prospect, but I'll consider it. Oh, no. I didn't mean to suggest that you should do it. In fact, you should avoid the area just southwest of here. At least until I work up the courage to do what needs to be done. I like how she um, hints at where this troll is, you know, just for me to go deal with it. Troll on the loose near a hamlet. That could be devastating. Let's go deal with him. We need to collect troll bogies anyway. There you are. I take oh. it you're Alexandra's friend. Level twenty. No, we'll 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 try. We'll do it. that to himself. Ow! You know what? I've hardly touched this guy and he's already like... Rude. Why are my buttons not working?
problem with my game stop lagging. Awful for Alexander, but the Hamlet needed to be saved from that troll. Lovely troll bogies. It's done, Alexandra. I took care of him. My troll? What? Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. I wish things could have turned out differently for him. Any plan you had to train that thing was doomed. He tried to kill me the entire time. Goodness. I'm glad you're all right. You're very brave. People in the hamlet had already crafted a moniker for whoever eventually defeated my... I mean, that troll. It was troll something or other. Vanquisher? Yes, that was it. I suppose it's your title now. I need some time on my own. But truly, thank you for what you did. The troll vanquisher. I suppose I did earn the title. Ooh, I'm about to level up again. Hello. Might you have time to help with an urgent delivery? Um... Okay, Falcroft is being attacked. That's not good. You sound as if you could use some help. How fortunate to see you. The, um... What was it? Troll? Slayer? Or Vanquisher? Whisperer? No matter. You clearly know how to get things done. Eddie Thistlewood's the name. Listen. A friend of mine in Feldcroft needs help fighting Rangrock's loyalists. I sent two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages to help, but they've gone missing. You sent crates of cabbages to battle Rangrock's loyalists? I did indeed. You see, I know plants, and I believe the goblins will be so irritated by the onslaught of ferocious vegetation, they'll simply leave Feldcroft alone. I wonder if you might track the two crates down and deliver their contents to my friend, Bernard Indiai. I simply can't leave my shop at present. Very well, sir. I shall keep an eye out for two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. Oh, thank you. I shall let Bernard know he might be receiving those cabbages after all. No, no pressure. What do you have for sale? I'm convinced that Feldcroft will be much safer with Chinese chomping cabbages defending them. Abby Sounds like Feldcroft's in trouble. Perhaps I should try to help. Thank you. I hope to see you again soon. Are those assignments coming along? Okay, that one's coming along. And cast a pulse out on a levitated enemy. I can do that. Wonder who lives here. Well, that's a long way away. Uh... No. All right. Well, we'll see about these. Chinese chomping cabbages next time. Colonel Ribbit signing out.